Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. Welcome to our conference. So this is the third day, uh, third and the last day of our conference, uh, conference of a project called Biocompact. Uh, throughout the three days uh, of our conference, uh, we have uh, uh, showed you what the project is about, what are the goals and outputs of the project. And today we have the final day uh, where we will um, tell you more about um, the environmental issues of biocomposite packaging and we will also try to sum up um, the project also presenting uh, our final output. So um, our conference was planned as, as, a, as a real and tangible event with direct human inter interaction but unfortunately 2020 had different plans as we all know. Uh, so we made this 100% online uh, event and an affair. Uh, even so, I still hope that this uh, conference uh, will be very interesting for you, that two previous days uh, were interesting, and today will also be interesting and fascinating, and that will give you an insight into the value chain of uh, biocomposite packaging. Um, my name is Greg Ganczewski. I represent Łukasiewicz Research Network Institute of Biopolymers and Chemical Fibers in Warsaw, Poland, and I am a uh, project partner and um, leader of work package three of this project uh, and uh, today actually I will be telling you more about uh, work package three and what we've done within this work package. Uh, I am your host here uh, so uh, before we move on to, uh, to, some, to some other attractive issues uh, just a couple of uh, technical points to make. Uh, I made the same points uh, the day before yesterday and yesterday but uh, just for the uh, all of you new here, uh, couple couple of points to make. So um, our conference today uh, lasts a couple of hours. We want to close the conference by, uh, by, by one, so it won't take that long. And you will have plenty of uh, breaks, so uh, hopefully uh, you will not get too bored. Um, our conference has a question and answer session. Mm. Uh, after each uh, after each of the presentation, we have three presentations today. So after each of the presentation, you will have time to interact uh, with the speakers, uh, and uh, you will be able to do it uh, via uh, chat. You can see the chat on your uh, right uh, hand side. And um, uh, if you have any questions uh, throughout the conference or in the question and answer session, just write them to the chat, and uh, the speakers will uh, answer you uh, or try to answer you all. Uh, all, uh, all the questions that you can have. The chat is moderated, so you can also post technical problems here, and we have Kasia here who will try to uh, solve it for you. Uh, and also our conference is recorded, and it will be uploaded to uh, YouTube uh, a few days in the future, and you will all get a link uh, to this upload uh, on the same email that you registered your, uh, to, to the conference. So I hope everything is clear. Please remember, if you have any problems, uh, like feel, feel free to, uh, to uh, write to us, you can write to uh, directly uh, chat to me or uh, to my contact team or just write on the chat and uh, uh, we will try to take care of all your problems. And with this out of the way, I would like to invite Andre again, just to tell us a few words about uh, uh, what will happen today. Okay, thank you very much, Greg. Uh, thank you for walking us through this event. I feel like a five-year-old, you know, that you know holds somebody's hand, and that's you. Thank you uh, for the full support. Um, we're in the third and last day, so of course we'd like to wrap it up and bring to some uh, conclusion. Okay, come on. Uh, and bring this whole story to some conclusion. And of course, our conclusion is the expert group that will um, uh, function, uh, that's organized now and will start functioning and providing a service after the end of the project. That'll be our end. Uh, today, we have still uh, two very interesting presentations. One by Professor Kowalczuk, uh, on the issue of packaging. Packaging is uh, really the core of our focus for two reasons, because the amount of packaging is huge. Let's say in plastics, you can sort of estimate that approximately one third of all plastics is used in packaging, which is a huge amount. 
And of course, it becomes waste very quickly. Uh, and even, you know, we have a trend of growing amount. So, so I think packaging really uh, should be a focus and is a focus. Not that other, other um, let's say, issues and products are not of interest. They are. But if we want to really make an impact, packaging is where you should look. Uh, and then we will have another uh, presentation uh, by uh, Dr. Graziano Eligier. Uh, Graziano uh, is definitely an expert in waste management, particularly of paper. And as I've said in the first day, uh, packaging, uh, uh, recycling of paper will be one of the preferred options that we'll be following for, for a few reasons, and I'm sure Graziano will mention those. But of course, it's important to understand the end of life what options there are, what limitations, what parameters, what's important, because only there can we actually figure out if we were successful, if that works. It's not putting a product on the market uh, and the product functioning. It's the whole story that has to function, and the whole story includes the waste management step. So Graziano will explain that to us. I'm very much looking forward to that story as well. And then, on this background, uh, Greg and I will uh, step in and explain to you a little bit more about the expert uh, group uh, service that we will launch uh, with this project and the thing that will remain after the end of the project. Uh, this was uh, a task that uh, Greg was in charge of. So Greg knows most about it. Uh, and I will try to assist and help uh, so that we bring this story to a, a logical conclusion and to an optimistic conclusion for the future. Uh, with that, I will stop. Uh, I'm very, very happy that um, you are with us here. Um, it's uh, it's always a question how these virtual events will go, but I have to say um, they're going very well. I think we'll, we're all adapting and learning how to do it and trying to get the most out of it. And I think it, it also brings opportunities that perhaps we don't have when we have the proper, normal, traditional conference where we all meet together and chat. We can do it this way, possibly even better sometimes. So let's go on with the program. Back to you, Greg, and um, enjoy.